lifestyle, if you've got an oil filter stuck on a Rev2 or any car, any other car, you might use something similar to this. That loops around it, you screw it in, tighten it up, and it gives you leverage to open up. You can't really get this in anywhere on the Rev2. Um, and there's not really a lot of room to get a chain device or any other small ones that you might normally use. So, what we're going to use is a long metal pipe. You can use a screwdriver, but if you use a screwdriver, you're almost guaranteed to pierce the, uh, the oil filter and get oil absolutely everywhere. Um, so, by using this, um, you can use wood, although wood tends to sort of split rather than give way to the oil filter. I'll put it on the corner of the oil filter. Even though it's round, there's sort of ridges. And I'm just going to hit the corner a few times. Okay, and it's already starting to move. That might have loosened it enough. We'll just have a little bit. No, right, here we go. That's it, just give it a twist. And there she is. I'll just show you basically what I did. So I came in, this was fresh, sort of on one of those corners. You see that? Hammered that down and then just you can see what happens, that sort of takes off and then it just gives that little bit of leverage to twist. Um, oh, and again, just stops you piercing the actual oil filter so you don't get one of them. How to remove a, how to remove a stuck oil filter? You know, well, one on many ways, but you know, a lot of people out there, who, especially if you are aspiring mechanics like we were talking about earlier, not that that was an expensive tool, but you know, some of these specialist tools can be quite expensive. Um, there's a long metal bar, you, anything really, that, you know, it doesn't have to be that, it can be anything. Just, yeah, 